Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, as you can see here, I have multiple boxes of bottles. Now, Jerry Peepals, as I've told you about before, or at least he's given me stuff before that you've seen, uh, he got a bunch of bottles, some from his brother, some from another person, um... And he uh, gave a whole lot of them to me. Um, so I'm going to show you all of the bottles he gave me. Um, uh, the first box isn't all that great. Uh, he, he said they were more junky bottles, but they're still bottles. Um, and an insulator. Alright, so let's start in here. So first is a... Nice little uh, Waterman's Inkwell. Uh, it's factory made. It's not my oldest Inkwell, but it's still an Inkwell. And I do collect Inkwells. So, that's going to look good in the collection. Now, I do have a bit of a situation, please. Uh, someone, if you can give me advice on... Sorry, I'm just going to put you down for a second. The best way to display my bottles... Uh, or, and store them, uh, because I am running out of space, which is not a good thing. Because if I run out of space, uh, then I won't be able to store any of my bottles, uh, which could make multiple situations that I don't really want to deal with, because if I find too many bottles, or get given too many bottles, then, uh, uh, I won't really be able to go out and dig bottles because I won't have the space. So first thing, well actually after the drink well is a little Sloan's uh, Lindemint bottle. Uh, nice little one. I think it might be factory made. Uh, that's gonna go back here. Oops. Alright. That made a loud sound. And then a big slick bottle with a cork top. It's gonna go at the bottom here. This beautiful hexagonal bottle. It says uh, Epto Mag Ep No Mag Megan or C U D E. I'm gonna put that up here. And then, three milk bottles, this one says Sheffield 10T, or actually no, one quart, and there's a big four on it, Sheffield Farms Company. Next is a bottle with a lot of stuff, it says Island Brand Raw Milk Company. So that's pretty cool. And another one that says uh, Borden's Milk. Uh, so those are pretty cool. Okay. And then I'm probably not going to show you everything. A cool little cork top. A nice color on there. A couple soda bottles. Some Coke bottles. Uh, this is actually a fairly interesting jar, uh, the sort of smaller size for the top here, very uncommon, um, a Whitehall Tantum insulator, or actually no, it's Whitehall Tatum, an E.L. Kearns bottle, another little cork medicine, and a couple beers, and that's about it for this box, and in this little box here, it's awesome, this stuff, um, I got this little Bromo seltzer, which is actually from this big box here. So I could just pop that in with the other Bromo. Then, first thing in here. Oh, wow! What the? No way! Wow! I did not expect that. There's a whole bunch of shark teeth in here. There's some big ones. And some pieces of whalebone and. That's really cool. I was not expecting that. Thank you so much, Jerry, for that. I, I, that caught me off guard. I didn't see them in there the first time. And then, another really good bottle. 
really nice squat bottle. Don't have any of this color. It says Connell Taloon, uh, Bordentown, New Jersey. It's gonna go up with my best bottles. Um, and then also, which is definitely going out with my best bottles, is my first straight sided Coke. But it's not just any, this is an amber straight sided Coke. These ones are very, very collectible and pretty rare, um, at least around here. So, this is a really good bottle to have. Uh, Jerry said that it was worth close to $100, so that's awesome. And then, in this big box here, I'm not going to read out all of the names because I have limited space on my phone. But lots and lots of blob tops. I'll show you the first level here. Um, I'm not going to read this out. Maybe I'll read these all out in another video. But if you want to read what these are, you can just pause the video. Um, oops, I almost dropped one. Really nice hexagonal one or octagonal. Uh, uh, one that's purpling, so that's awesome. I love the purpling blobs. Um, what else? Oops. Uh, another one. Uh, I, lo I love these slug plates. It's like blobs with uh, just uh, non uh, slug plate aren't as cool. I think I have two of these bottles. Um, and I'm probably gonna give away one of the bottles I have two of to a uh, friend of mine who digs bottles. Uh, probably. I mean, that was the request of Jerry. So that's it for now. Um, I'll be back if I uh, get anything else interesting or if I find something interesting about one of the bottles. See ya!